decided to ask uh, the patient uh, for some examinations. We did the laboratory examinations. We ran a COVID test, HIV and hepatitis. All of them came in a negative. We did a complete blood test, and by that we identified um, anemia present with uh, low, low, low iron because uh, the kid has been uh, in with this situation for more than three months, and so her absor absorption of, uh, of nutrients are compromised, um, and she's also with like decreased um, appetite. So she's not taking nutrients and all. And we can also uh, observe eosinophilia and lipocytosis, leukocytosis. And by stool analysis that we also run, we, it can show the presence of the Ascariasis eggs. Okay, by the, by the instrumental, oh, we also did uh, erythrocyte mutation rate and it's increased. Uh, we did also albumin and bilirubin tests to see the, the liver. Okay, by the instrumental examinations, we asked for x-ray. In the x-ray, we can see obstruction. So it's not... If we, if we see this, <coughs> the situation in the x-ray, it's clear that there is obstruction. So... Um, Contrast may not even be necessary. Um, so, okay, we did x-ray and also we did ultrasound in the abdomen. And by that, we can see that there is obstruction in the right iliac region. Um, and x-ray also shows social and social obstruction. Mm, we did also the x-ray of the lungs. So we can uh, say that there is no problem in the lungs because the patient was coughing mm. and so we discarded uh, respiratory problems and there is no presence of worms in the in the respiratory system mm. that's it right